So you have elements of the, of the campaign, but the one element that's going to be consistent is the character, the logo. And then you have the different uh, pieces of collateral. So this big one right here is a poster, and then this over here is a web banner, and this is like a social post, and maybe this is a postcard. Um, so the sketch itself, the sketch is you're working on the character, you know, so most wanted um, uh, germ free. So you're playing off of the words too, most wanted, and the most, this is basically the name of the campaign. You know, this is the most wanted campaign. Germs are, the germs would be tar targeted by the product in this case? Yeah, like a germ free world, let's say. Oh, okay. Most wanted, a germ free world, and then the character down here is, um, uh, oops is part of that product, let's say, so. So the word most wanted has to be there? Yes. Yeah, that's part of the campaign. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like, just think of movie posters. You know, you have the title for the poster, and then you have the elements, the images that make up the poster, but that title is always consistent. So if you see an advertisement for, you know, uh, the Avengers, you know, um, whether it's a movie poster or a banner or Instagram post, they all share the same uh, design and main title, you know, throughout the whole campaign. So the campaign's always consistent. So you're keeping things consistent. And then the design would be consistent throughout. So you want to use the same colors, same fonts um, throughout the whole campaign itself. 